we're back with more Paranormal Sight, The Seven Mysteries of Hunjo. Or, well, nine. Well, maybe even fifteen. I'd like for them to explain that part, please. It's, it, just, well, really, there's more than seven, but they say seven because doesn't seven sound cooler? Seven's a nice, it's, it's a nice number for mysteries. It's like, the eleven curses of, of Hanjo. Eh, who cares? Can you the believe 11? the thirty-four mysteries of Hanjo? That's, oh my that's God. too many. I'm just not going to Hanjo. Today we're doing Escape from Komagata High! After Yako acquires the curse of the Fool's Procession, Mio tries to persuade her to give up on going, on, on going after the Rite of Resurrection. The effects of other curse echoes are already appearing at the school, so the two hurry to get out of the classroom! Oh no! <clears throat> oh no! Oh, sorry! <laughs> Inside Komagata High School. A lot of wedgies. Hey, Mio, what was that just now? Could it be another curse echo different from mine? I think so, yes. We may have been discovered by another curse bearer. Oh. Hmm? What's wrong? Shh. Someone's there, in that classroom. What? I said keep your voice down. Something moved inside. Well... Check it out stealthily, why don't we? It might be the curse bearer who used that curse echo just now. If we can see who it is, it might end up... Uh, it might help us decide what to do later. That's true. Okay, be careful. Do, 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 do. <laughs> Do, 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 do. Well, can you see anything? Try and get a look around. Oh, uh, there's gonna be a jump scare in there. Uh, 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 oh. Uh huh? Huh? Is that our homeroom teacher, Mr. Jonochi? I knew it! And the person with him is Hitomi from Class A? I knew it! Hitomi, that slut! Oh my goodness! <laughs> oh golly gosh! <laughs> oh my! What is going on here? A curse! Ah! That bastard! He's at it again! I knew it! Knew it couldn't be trusted. I have to kill him. Uh, 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 kill! No, kill! Kill! No, kill! Murder! No, kill! No, murder! Kill! No, I won't no, let him get away uh, with this. It, murder! Uh, kill! What? No, stop. No, we're Maybe not. Maybe I can make his head explode no, with my mind. We don't need I to can do kill him with that. it. We don't need to do that. No, Yako, you can't use the curse stone. Use it, use it, use What's it, use 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 it, Who's there? Is someone there? This is bad. We have to go before they see us. I want him to see me. Uh, of interest, that's uh, one way to put it, yeah. I knew it. I called it. Uh, My urge to kill, lowering. <sighs> Seems like they're not coming after us. Let's hope they didn't see our faces. But, Yako, what came over you all of a sudden? <laughs> Sorry, thanks for stopping me. It's like this uncontrollable rage suddenly welled up inside me. I wonder what's gotten into me. I can barely even remember what happened. I'm really sorry. I do think it's partly the curse's influence on you, but we certainly saw something shocking. My heart's still pounding. Yeah, that's one way to put it. I'm a little surprised you know Hitomi from Class A. Yeah, she tends to stand out a lot. What with her dark hair and, and school uniform- wait a minute. Gotcha. Well, she certainly does dress like a delinquent, though she barely shows up to school. But Mr. Jonochi or Hitomi really be a curse bearer? Uh, oh, I, I, I um, I don't think we should turn around. But uh, I don't know. But we should be careful just in case. I love how the music has swelled because we see something they don't. Yako, yeah, don't turn around. Don't turn around. Hmm. Don't turn around, don't turn around, don't turn around. Oh my God. When I give the signal, <laughs> run. 
go straight for the entrance. <laughs> Don't look back, no matter what. Huh? Why? Did something happen? Something happened, didn't it? What about you, Mio? I'll be fine. We'll meet up outside the school gates. <laughs> I'm not there in ten minutes. Go straight home, okay? <laughs> Okay, go! Whoa! Right! Back. Don't look back! Was that a scream? Was that a scream? Or was that our feet? Or was that the curse? <sighs> I have to get outside. Let's see, to get to the gates, I go by the gym and... Oh, okay. Here we are. Hmm? What are you doing, miss? Uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh, no, eek. N oh. Mm, you shouldn't be here this late. Uh, don't you know what time it is? Oh, Mr. Ashimiya. Well, if it isn't little Yako. How do you know my name? Anyways, a student ain't supposed to be outside playing around at night. School janitor, Makoto Ashimiya! Da -da 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 -da! He's a person of interest. I know you're rough around the edges, but I didn't take you for one to act out like this. I'm not acting out, you're acting out. I'm not acting out. What about you? Should you be smoking on school grounds? Yeah, well, it ain't lit, so it's alright. It's, you know, an accessory. I just like the p taste of the paper. Hey, don't go change the subject. There's just no <laughs> letting my guard down with you. Uh, so, why are you here so late? Well, uh, please, please let us have the answer and bring back somebody from the dead. The truth is, I forgot something in my classroom. Again? You sure are a piece of work. Mm -hmm. But you don't have nothing with you. Oh. Wait, you do? What's that in your hand? Don't worry about it, don't worry about it, huh? Oh, shit. Well, um, this is what I forgot. I, uh, got it from my grandpa. It's really important to me. Hmm. Girls these days sure have weird tastes. Oh, well, okay. Better head straight home if you're done. I won't tell on you. Nope. Wait. I can't let you walk home alone this late. No. Yeah, Alright, wait just a little. No. I'll hurry and lock things up. Uh, but... Uh... I'm worried about me, huh? Yeah. Actually, a friend of mine is still inside. I think they'll be here soon. That's so? Who's your friend? Uh, my classmate, Miyu uh, Kurosuzu. Ah, that transfer student. Breaking school rules already, huh? Didn't take her for the type. <laughs> no, I was the one who dragged her here. Yeah, well, whatever. I'll go take a look. It'll be safer if we go home together. Oh, right. She's in the first floor hallways. Be careful, though. You don't know what may be there. What was that supposed to mean? First floor, yeah. I'll be right back. Do. Do, do. Yep. Do. 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 Boom, 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 boom. God, I love this art style. Especially when the ghosts start showing up. Also, it looks like everything's through a fisheye lens. Have you noticed that? It's been almost an hour. Well, it's supposed to be through a television, you see. Yeah, I can kind of see that. She's late. I've been waiting for 20 or 30 minutes, but there's no sign of her. Mm. I'm starting to get worried. Yeah, we haven't seen him yet, either. I'm going to take a look. Do, 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 do. Do, la, 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 la. Neo? Are you there? Oh, big reveal. Here it is. Yikes. Uh, look up slowly. Ah. Uh, Mia, what happened? Oh, that's not good. Where did I go wrong this time? 
Oh, it's my fault. It's all my fault. Did her leg get ripped off? I think it did. I left her alone with a curse bearer. Mio. Yeah, I don't think it was. I'm sorry. I... The truth is that I... she got hit by a curse bearer. Wait. Not the curse, the curse bearer. A curse bearer. And then she got got too. Oh, that was a bad ending, by the way. You did the wrong thing. Hey, that's okay. That was cool. My my, Tetsune Tio, you seem to have arrived at a less than favorable result. <laughs> but this was bound to happen. There is someone who must not be trusted. That sounds familiar, doesn't it? If so, you may choose to withhold important information from that person. Fear not. You may try as many times as you like for the event in question. Yeah, I, I'm piecing it together. Let's try again. Very well. Goody. All right. <laughs> Let's leave without waiting. Mm hmm? But you don't have nothing with you. Oh. You're right. Oh, wait, you do. What's that in your hand? Huh? No, Let's don't see. show it again. Girls these days sure have weird tastes. Remember what Mio said to us. Before, just before she gave the signal. Just leave. Just leave. You don't need to worry about Mio. Again, it wasn't the curse that killed her, it was the curse bearer. So the curse bearer found her, and killed her, then killed us. I bet you I know who the next curse bearer is! Who do you think it is? The guy we're talking to. Hmm. He's most likely... No thanks, mister! I'm good! Bye! He's most likely the old serial killer. He has a bad habit of tearing people apart. Oh, right! Mr. Junoichi was actually looking for you inside the main building. Yeah, go kill him instead. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Who was that? He's here right now? What's he thinking? I don't know. He was in class 3B on the second floor just a bit ago. hee <laughs> hee. Oh, well, I suppose that means I can't be locking up yet. Second floor, you said? I'll go take a peek. Be back in a jiff. Mm-hmm. Uh, my house is really close by. I'll be fine on my own, really. Uh, that's so? Ah, the snack shop, right? Yeah, I suppose you'll be fine then. Be careful now, you hear? Stay in the big walnut streets. If something happens, shout fire! Okay. You worry too much. Well, we wouldn't want to be losing any more students. Ha 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 ha! Oh, I imagine you'd know that better than anyone. Yes, you're right. I don't know why the Pink Panther themes <laughs> just jumped into my head. Ooh, this is probably when we got caught through the first timeline. Mio's late. Been waiting for 20 or 30 minutes, but there's no sign of her. Huh? There's someone coming down the road. That's... Oh. Oh, no, a, a teacher. It's Mr. Ari... Araishi. 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 He looks on edge. I wonder what he's doing. Curse, 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 curse. Wait. He's the one who discovered the rite of resurrection. It wouldn't be strange for him to be involved with the curses. I wonder if he has a curse stone. What do I do? Kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him. It's way past the ten minutes Mio said she'd be here by. I managed to escape. I can't let that go to waste. I need to get out of here before anyone sees me. Curse, 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 curse. That's how you find a curse bearer. It's like, oh boy, I sure hope nobody curses me. Curse, 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 curse. <laughs> I came as soon as I heard. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Sorry, you curse bearer too. Curse. <laughs> ah, I'm home. Thank goodness. I don't think the walk has ever felt so long. Nobody will be able to use their curse once it's light outside. I need to go look for Mio as soon as it's morning. But for now, I need some rest. Yeah, you're the you're the safest where you can be right now. In bed, asleep, it's two o'clock, Yako's done for the day.
That her, her, her chapters are done now for a while. She's in bed. We're gonna see her tomorrow. I, 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 you can see at the top, a little timeline. Night in the day. Ooh. For the game continues into the next day. It's not over yet. Oh, man. All right, we've got information. I think we can move on. That is true. So now we can... Uh, How do we? Let's see right here was the was the bad ending, you know, where we uh, decided to send Mio to her doom, but uh, now she has a way to get away, and uh, Yaku's asleep and all good, so now we can go back to Hare Shigima's A Nice Thought. Just resume the chapter. Now is it gonna bring us back to right where we needed to make a choice? Start from the conversation on the bridge. Oh, good. <laughs> so... What's next? Yeah, the big question now is what the rest of the Cursed Bears are up to. <laughs> Luckily, the Sumida River is a good distance from any of the Seven Mysteries. I wonder how we'll know what the other Cursed Bears are it's up unlikely to. the other Cursed Bears will come all the way here. I can finally have a moment to think. I see. Alright. Excuse me? Mm hmm? Who that? Hello. <laughs> Hi. Where did she come from? It's like she appeared out of nowhere. Oh, hi. I didn't mean to startle you. I'm terribly sorry if I've gotten the wrong people, but would you happen to be curse bearers? She's a curse bearer too? Curse bearers? What's that then? Um, it means someone who's <laughs> gathering souls for the Rite of Resurrection. Uh, you have heard of the Rite of Resurrection, haven't you? Everyone's talking about it. I wasn't eavesdropping. Color me intrigued. Care to tell me more, Miss... Uh, what's your name again? Oh, silly me. I'm Ayami Tono. University student! Ayami Tono! Woo! Hi, Ayami. She says her name's Ayame. I guess she's around 20. She must be brave, walking around alone this late. In or maybe there's fit. more to it. <laughs> I would just like it if every time you're staring at her, she just goes, Hi. <laughs> <laughs> just kind of spacing out a bit. There's more to the right of resurrection than makes the eye of sir. She gets more and more valley girl as the night goes on. It's going to devolve, yes. <laughs> so the best way to collect soul drag is to kill other cursebearers. That's about the size of that. I hope it wasn't too much to follow. No, no, I think I got the gist. Funny old world we live in, huh? So, are you saying you're one of these curse bearers? No, well, not quite. It's complicated. I'm not, but Yutaro is. Yutaro? Is that your boyfriend? Oh, heavens no. Just a friend. His full name is Yutaro Namigake. <laughs> or, I suppose you could say partners in crime? And she just gave away everything. Funny way of putting it. Oh my god. Let's talk about this, Yutaro Namigaki. Is Yutaro pussy boy? <laughs> so where is this Yutaro now? Yeah, where is he? He's the guy who uh, tried to kill us with his, you know, yeah, Now the voice of yeah, my exactly. curse will... Uh, <laughs> sorry, can't, can't hear you, Sonny. Hearing aid's on the fritz. Anyway, give me your curse turn or I'll shoot you. Oh, I love that. He's not a curse bearer anymore, <laughs> so, so he lived. He's, actually, he's more like a farmer curse bearer. Former? How so? He got his shit fucked up. I don't really know the details myself, but apparently he lost his car stone. Typical, right? He must have show <laughs> being a top stone on all the top like where So now I'm out here looking for curse bearers myself. You want something done right. She is going to get herself and everyone around her killed. Uh, so anyway, mind if I ask you why you thought I was a curse bearer? Oh, that. I'm terribly sorry. I was just so rude. I heard you talking about it. I saw told you out late at night, and I suppose I made assumptions. Gotcha. Sorry if we gave you the wrong idea. Out of interest, what was your plan if we did turn out to be curse bearers? Oh, Jesus. It's a great question, and the answer is, I was going to ask you very nicely for your curse stones. God, I... <laughs> you know you were you giving it up to you to forget? Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> Well, maybe not, but you know what they say, you never know until you ask. I, I really want the detective's curse stone to see if she's bullshitting us right now. You must really love your boyfriend if you're willing to try something that risky. Exactly! Oh, thank, oh goodness, now we're just friends. Oh wow, he even got friend-zoned. My life doesn't revolve around him, you know. 
so she might have her own motivations. Anyway, you aren't curse bearer, so I'm just bothering you, aren't I? Play as ignore me! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, you are so doomed. Uh, so what are you trying to do with this Red of Resurrection? Well, Yutara has his own plan all laid out. I don't know if I can get behind it, though. It seems... How do I put it? Self-centered? <sighs> Well, I, mean, I mean, if you got a chance to resurrect a dead, it would be a waste to not to use it on someone that really matters, right? So I was planning to steal his curse stone at the last second to use it for myself. Wow. Well, I totally lost it anyway. The dark. Jesus. Oh, uh, but don't tell you Tara I was gonna do that, okay? I don't think he'd be happy to hear that. Of course, keeping secrets is my business. My heart, you dashing. This girl, <laughs> this girl is killing me. Haraway, Haraway's <laughs> face is just selling it for me. Uh huh. Uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> anyway. Sounds like you really have your heart set on this right. What were you hoping to use it on? Do you promise you won't laugh? Her pet dog. Cross my heart. Well, then let me tell you my master plan. <laughs> Prepare to be amazed. <laughs> uh, I think we may have found my favorite character. Um. <laughs> I'm an art student, you say? What block prints are my specialty? Ukiyo-e in particular. Ukiyo-e. Ukiyo-e, huh? Huh. Must be a cultured lady. Really? You think so? <laughs> Cha! Everybody says it's a strange interest for a girl to have. Holy shit. You know, people often think of Ukiyo-e as some inaccessible high-class art form, but that's actually totally untrue! I mean, back in the old period, it was the art for the masses! Amusement was for the common people! I would love it if Harue started squinting more and more, the more your accent devolved. Uh, 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 can we leave now, please, Richter? Here's a lighter. <laughs> <laughs> so when you think about it, we feel exactly the same thrills from every brushstroke as they did back then! Isn't that fascinating? You know, it kind of is. I feel her, uh, when you're reading my Heian diaries from like, you know, 1000 AD. <laughs> you know, you know... It was like, you know, writing was a woman's thing for a while because while the men ran the country, the women kind of tended to the empress and just kind of wrote in their spare time. How interesting. Yeah, yeah I guess. But as far as I'm concerned, the undisputed king of Ukiyo is the one and only Hokusai. Yeah, it definitely is. Do you, do, do you know that art of, like, the big tidal wave? Oh, yeah, that was her? That's, oh, that's Hokusai, yes. Oh, cool. Have you heard of him? Oh, him, excuse me. Sure I have, he's famous. Didn't he live somewhere around here, back in the Edo period? That's right! You're just as knowledgeable as Illock! Oh yeah, there it his is. 36 views of Mount Fuji are so iconic that the only works of his- uh, the only works of his most people know. But Hokusai was so much more than just mountains and waves! He was also waves and mountains! Oh, it's only the teeny tiny tip of a veritable iceberg of water! See, look! You could see the iceberg there! It's a mountain. I, I gotta admit, I only really know him from those landscapes myself. <laughs> well, don't worry about it. Anyone can learn. Let me tell you. Okay. When Hokusai died at the age of 90, he lived behind over 30,000 drawings. That's multiple drawings a day for 80 years! Amazing, right? So he kept on drawing right up until his old age, huh? Impressive. But even in his final years, he was never satisfied with his own work. His dying words were should have been for me, but five more years I shall finally become a true artist. Even on his deathbed, he still thought he had more to learn. He was already the greatest painter and artist of his era. Who knows what he could have done with more time? That's what I want to find out. Is that considered selfishness? Eh, uh, probably. Maybe a little less self-centered, because we're bringing back a great artist, which right. could benefit all of humanity, because he's right. Because, hey, you know, he wanted more time to be a great artist, maybe we can give him that time. Well, now he also has it's just, modern... It's just ludicrous and far-fetched. <laughs> oh, yeah, definitely. <laughs> oh, hold on. Are you saying... Besides, he's always said he wanted to move out of a hundred houses, but he only made it to 93. Isn't that just tragic? Uh-huh. Oh, no. Nah. No way this is going where I think it's going. Imagine the masterpieces he could create with modern techniques! I feel all dizzy just thinking about it! <laughs> You've gotta be kidding me. Oh, yes. My favorite character is here. So, if I understand correctly, you want to use the Rite of Resurrection to... That's right! I want to bring Hokusai back to life! Well, that's certainly a novel idea. Ah, <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> Thank you. <laughs> That's what she'd use it on? What a waste. I mean, hers is selfish, but... Uh, albeit a lot more noble. Definitely. 
He's like, what if we can wish back Osama Tezuka? He can make a lot more manga! Let's <laughs> talk more about Yutaro. He, he, he lost it. How did he do that? I wasn't with him at the time, so I don't know exactly how what happened. All I know is that he came back saying he didn't have it anymore. Although, well... It's strange that you probe into that, of all things. I'm just the curious sort, that's all. Sorry if it's a touchy subject. Oh, I don't mind. I don't particularly care about keeping it a secret. <laughs> oh gosh, is that the time? I should be going. I need to get my hands on a curse bear before daybreak. <laughs> Sorry for flogging you down out of the blue like that. Best of luck! Bye! D just when she was about to, to sniff us out is when yep. she's like, okay, bye! Later! Uh, huh. well, by the way, gotta say, I love Richter's dialogue. It is extremely believable on how... When you're when it looks like a red flag is about to be raised, you detour and go around it so that you don't cause suspicion. Yeah, well, there goes trouble. Uh huh. We're going after cursed stones, we should keep an eye on her. Two, if we can. Make it four. Why do you say that? Before she left, she wished us best of luck. She's got at least an inkling that we're curse bearers. My. There's a good chance we'll clash sooner or later. We're after the same thing, after all. You head on back to the mansion, ma'am. I'll think I'll tailor for a while. Oh my god, that was that was magical. <laughs> I absolutely <laughs> love that. Oh my god. Oh, okay. So Hattori's got one more thing. Uh, Yako went to bed, and now she is too. No uh, more curses. Oh, 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 she she stopped her her uh, suspend points. Now she's going to bed. Okay. Easy as that. Three a.m. We're getting there. I mean. That's late even for me. 2 a.m. is normally when I go to bed. Yeah, normally. If I can't fall asleep by 2, it ends up being 3 to 4. It sucks. Back here again. I left Richter to continue looking for curse bearers. Back to the house again. Not again. Back to the house again. Mostly. And came home alone. Looks nice. Calming area. <laughs> bad ending. Bad ending. Somebody's waiting inside. Good night. What? Ah, oh, come on. What wait, the... seriously? That was it? That was it. That's all. Yep. So what was the point of the wait here thing? Probably just to look outside and to, you know, drink in the scenery. Wow, yeah. scenery. You know, be more, be a bit more somber about it. That that chapter is basically supposed to be the end of Hardaway. You know, her, she's going to bed. You clear this chapter, okay? The end of her night. Y yes, because okay. it, it coincides with Yako going to bed too. Oh, uh, okay, okay, okay. Cool. <laughs> so now, just before daybreak. Yes, 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 yes. You got one more chapter. Tetsuo Tsutsumi. Gets oh, a threatening phone here call. We go. After persuading Araishi, the curse bearer of the ever burning lantern, to give up his stone, Tatsumi and Aryo have obtained three curse stones in total. They continue their investigation of the town in search of the remaining curse bearers. Well, one already went home, so. Yeah. But another. Well, two went home, actually. Mm hmm. Yeah. Two went home, so they're gone. It's 4 a.m. Oh, jeez. Jeez. I'm like, I'm like hating myself at this point. Mm hmm. Same. Road. Oh, it's Road, actually. It's rude, okay. You got me. <laughs> well, with this, we'd have visited every place connected to the Seven Mysteries. This is the last spot, huh? And we've got nothing to show for it. Even though every last location looks, looks suspect from top to bottom. Maybe we, can't, maybe we came at the wrong time. There might not have been any curse bears around. Sounds like we'll need to do another round before morning comes, then. <laughs> I could kiss you, Ariel. <laughs> or maybe. <laughs> smoochie, smoochie, smoochie. Someone's been observing our movements. Dun dun dun. Huh? What? No way. Just a thought. Either way, we should check out this last place. Let's hope we finally get a lead. Oh. I didn't see anything back there. All right, moving to Kinshibori Park. Isn't this where this started? Fuck! God damn it! Gah. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What the hell is this? Is... is he dead? Damn it, we were too late. Was this a curse too? Hey, hang on. 
I'm gonna call this in. I'll leave it to you. I'm gonna take a look around. Okay, so our protagonist, protagonist, quote-unquote, was always meant to die. At least, as it seems. Boss, bad news. What is it? Another mysterious death was reported in the area just now. The medical unit and forensics team are on their way, but it'll be a while before they arrive. Ah, it is bad news. So they got someone else. You think this is the work of a curse bearer? Well, no shit. Well, look Ariel. at him. Yeah, here we go. Look at him. I think. I think. You know. I think I might have been a. You know, a mugger. It's a. It's a. It's a, it's a mugging gone bad. Yeah, just a guy comes up and says, "Give me your wallet, curse." <laughs> and there we go. Yeah, you got the wallet and everything. With another suspicious deaths popping up one after another, we have to assume it. Shit. Guess we'll be stuck waiting around for a while. Time to take in the scenery. Or talk. Yeah, let's, let's have a little chat. I got nothing to say, Ario. Huh? Boss, that phone is ringing. Oh, this should be good. Uh... This should be good. Oh, this mm. should be good. Yes, give me the phone call. Well, you better go check it out. You're right, but be careful. It could be a curse. Hey, I said we. You expect me to go alone? I don't want to go over there! You're the one who's tough against this stuff. Don't worry, boss, you can do it. Go on now. Uh, damn it. <clears throat> um, hello. Uh, Kinshibori Park phone booth. Evening, Detective Tsutsumi. How are things looking out there? Who is this? <laughs> I finally got him. The real deal. Detective Tetsuo Tsutsumi himself. Ah, uh, wait. That's Chief Inspector Tsutsumi now, isn't it? You've come a long way since we last met. I asked you to identify yourself. Man, have you forgotten already? After all the time we spent together? What a time that was. As I recall, I give you quite the runaround. Wait. Is this... Fumichika Nejima? What? Did you say Fumichika Nejima? Like the one from the Nejima murders? Is that on parole? Mm. Uh, no. No. <laughs> Ding, 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 you got it. I had a feeling that the Grave Chief, Chief Satsumi would remember me. I spent 20 long years in a cell thanks to you. That shit was not easy. You should be thanking me. Should have given you plenty of time to think and atone for your sins. <laughs> that did it. I've repented. My conscience is clean as a whistle. Bullshit. 20 years in prison doesn't even begin to make up for the shit you did. I don't know about that. After all, the justice system was gracious enough to grant me parole. What? <laughs> if this is the real Fumichika Nejima, he must still have a grudge against me for arresting him. So is this payback. Damn it. <sighs> What's your goal? What is your goal? Now, now, you gotta understand. I've repented, seen the light. I've been a good boy since I was granted parole. Why do you sound like Jack Nicholson on a stroke? I even got myself a job. I'll be real serious about walking the right path. Well, it's very nice. Keep it up. No problem, Chief. But it was no good. When the opportunity arose, it was impossible to hold myself back. I knew I had to give you a little token of thanks, or I'd never truly be able to have a fresh start. Do you get what I'm saying? No thanks. I don't need anything. No need to do all that for me, just try to live a quiet life. Oh, no can do. It's no hassle, no hassle at all. It would be all too easy to just kill you, to tear you apart. But that wouldn't be very satisfying. Certainly not after twenty fucking years of waiting. 
That's a long time to nurture a grudge. You fucking bet it is. I let it gnaw at me, grow inside of me. I thought of nothing else. All that time, I played model prisoner. Endured the harassment those asshole guards threw at me. And I did it all for you, Tsutsumi. So please, just accept my deepest and most sincere feelings. Sorry, but I'm afraid I don't feel the same way about you. Shut the fuck up! That attitude of yours is why I'm saving you for last! How did you find me? How do you know where I am? <laughs> That's my favorite part! The sound of confusion in your voice. It's to die for. Mmm, this is delicious. I can't get enough. Put your pants back on. I'm not telling you shit! Zoop. How fun wrecking your tiny little brain for it! <laughs> what are you planning? Whatever it is, bring it on. I'm not running away. I just told you I'm not coming for you yet! Pay attention when people talk, shithead! You see, this time... This time, I want to see you on your knees, weeping in despair, begging me for mercy. <laughs> no. <laughs> wow, oh no, I'm so sorry to Nejima. please forgive me, I won't do it again. Shut the fuck up! This is actually why I've always hated you so fucking much! It was worth a shot. <laughs> <laughs> Did you really think that would sate me, your oo face? Asshole! You must be crazy. Well, then we're both crazy. We've got so much in common, we should be friends. Enjoy cracking your jokes while you still can! I'm going to kill everyone you care about, one by one, till there's no one left. By the way, When a Stranger Calls is my favorite horror movie, in case you were asking. SHUT THE FUCK UP! I, you know, I, I have a great way to scare off the, the screen killer. And he says, you know, Hey, what's your favorite scary movie? Just go, last house on the left. <laughs> That's a movie where, you know, killers invade the home and get their shit rocked. Yep. <laughs> Sorry to disappoint, but I'm a lone wolf. I don't have anyone like that in my life. Uh, uh, boss, what about me? Shh, shh, shh. Did I hear a, did I hear a greenhorn? Nope, nope, I'm kill nope. It. It's an unrelated. Kill it. Hey, is that a curse bearer? Hey, you. Uh. <laughs> hey, can you curse over the phone? Curse. Ah. Oh wait, are you just trying to protect me? Shut up. Mario. Shut up. There's not a single person you care about. I wonder what your sweet daughter would think if she were here, uh, were to hear that. Good. Don't you fucking dare! I'm warning you! Ooh, very nice. This is more like it. <sighs> She's living all on her own, isn't she? Attending university and all? Such a good girl. <sighs> oh my. Don't tell me that she just happens to live in Hanjo. What? She does? No, forget it. This isn't funny, asshole. I'm gonna find you and make you pay. Ah, I love it. Keep going. I want to hear you lose your mind. It's music to my ears. <sighs> Fuck you. What's your goal? <laughs> How did you find me? <laughs> I guess I could give you a little hint. You asshole, I'm gonna fucking kill you. How dare you threaten my daughter? <clears throat> How did you find me? How'd you find me? <laughs> Go on. <laughs> well, you see. I have the one-sided reed. God! Tsutsumi, you have the evergreen beach, no? Nejima? You're a curse bearer? You're using the power of the curse! Indeed! What a peculiar curse it is! But that's where my hints end. <laughs> God damn it! The curse echo couldn't have fallen into worse hands. Kill, 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 go, kill you gonna, everyone. What are you gonna do with it? Ah, one more thing we should discuss. In fact, it's the most important thing. I got black slacks. Should I wear brown socks or blue socks? Does white really go with black? 
I, I need uh, to dress up for later. Um, it's gonna be one hell of a party. I thought you were finally going to shut up. I'm already sick of you, so I'll pass. Oh, but you don't want to miss this. It's the main course. I could just go after your daughter, but something tells me you get bored. No, I'm good. Got me real fired up. You're in my head. Well done. But this is a gift Taylor made for you. I'm going to kill all the people you swore to protect. Every last person living here. You couldn't. Oh, but with this curse of mine, I can. I'll give you until dusk. By then, I could probably get a couple hundred people or so. And it'll be all be your fault. Oh, it must be so hard to know they're all died because of you. So tragic. It must be tearing you apart. <laughs> That's not funny. Don't fuck with me. There's no way an amateur like you could pull off a curse that strong. Unfortunately for you, all I needed was somebody who spoke like a valley girl. And who would that be? Hello. My curse stone is particularly a strong one. Which means I can have my fun without needing to hold back one bit. It's almost like the Feast of Shadows was cast just for me. You're surprisingly well informed about this. Who was it that tipped you off? Hmm. Who knows? Then how about I kill myself first and ruin all your fun? What about that, asshole? Curse me! <laughs> ah! Idiot. You think I'd call it off just because you were dead? There's no running away for you. Gah. I'll find you. I won't let you get away with this, Nechima. You've got 12 hours. Do you really think your paltry little organization will be able to make a dent in my plans? Oh, the sacrifices made will be heavy. I can't wait to see you sobbing with regret. <laughs> and I'll even have enough soul drinks to pull off the Rite of Resurrection. <laughs> Splendid! Wait, Nejima, you're after the- Anyway, see you around. Bye-bye now. Mm. Nah. Hey, boss, was it an okay call? Shut up! Oh. I mean, it was not an okay call. Uh. Boss? There we go. Did you catch all that? Nejima, what is he planning? Who knows? For now, we need to find him and get him into custody. Send word to HQ. But the fact that the seven mysteries, or nine, or fifteen, or whatever the fuck, are wrapped up in this <laughs> is gonna make things tricky. You mean, with Nejima being a curse bear? Just our luck, really. It couldn't have been a worse guy. Sounds like his curse will be able to kill a lot of people at once. I'd like to avoid getting our investigators caught in the crossfire. We'll use them to find out where he is. But then we're going in alone. It's getting lighter out. We should try to collect as many cursed stones as we can before then. Let's hurry. Aye aye, boss. Ooh, that just up the ante. Later. It was reported that a total of three suspicious deaths were discovered that night. Three? Nejima's threats, along with the curses, were kept secret from the general public. However, the Honjo serial killing still made international headlines following the death of police officer Hajime Yoshimi. Oh, there's the third. At Tsutsumi's request, a large-scale investigation was launched into Fumichiki... Uh, F Fumichika Nejima's whereabouts. Tsutsumi and Erio themselves spent the rest of the night looking for curse bearers in this area, but their search ended in vain. What? Oh, is this the end of their plotline? And with that, the curtain closed on that cursed night. Oh, it's just the end of the night. It is the end of chapter one, 12 hours to sunset. Oh. For now, the true overarching problem has reared its ugly head. Okay, two more stories have cropped up. That's right, we've got sorting things out and Hitomi's help, I think. Looks like Mio got out okay, oh thank Christ. <laughs> thank God, yeah. Looks like looks like Miss Haraway's still asleep. I mean, she's got a lot to think about, so we'll see her. Ma miss? Miss? Uh, well. Looking ahead, we've got, uh... Ooh, well, oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, oh. Well. Really now? The second act is about to kick into high gear. 
next time on Paranormasite.